London Heathrow Airport picking up the students to take them back to uh, Balliol College in Oxford. I'm from Italy. My name is Andrew Welton. I'm from Orlando, Florida. Hi, my name is Anna. I'm from Germany. I'm Tarek Lewis. I'm from Coconut Creek, Florida. My name is Maria. I'm from Russia. I'm UD10. I'm 15 and I'm from Singapore. My name is Chandika Basdeo. I'm from Florida. Hi, I'm Leo Gittleman. I'm 16 years old. I go to the Lamont Manhattan School in New York. I'm Carolina Torrens. I'm from Miami, Florida. Hi, I'm Johannes. I'm 17 years old. I'm from Germany and I love this program. Yeah, we're in London, man. We're in London. It's cool here. Look at this. Look at these bikers. It's London, baby. London! Being in Oxford is awesome to be able to go out and explore the city and see all the great things on your own time. We have gone out and done pretty much anything that I would do if I was here by myself anyway. We have not missed one thing, seeing the London Eye and, and touring Parliament and going and seeing the Roman Baths, which was so cool to just get a historical context of, of everything that we have been learning about. We're in the London Eye looking, look at the Big Ben and Parliament buildings. This is the coolest thing I think I've ever done. Coming to this program, I really wanted to learn about democracy and get a little insight into government. But now that I've been here and experienced ideas that I've been exposed to, I really think I'm going to pursue government and follow up philosophy. So I really do believe that this course may have changed my future. Told you it was cheesy, but it's true. I don't think there is any politics course in my school. If I were to not have came here, I don't think I would learn so much about politics. And I've also made a lot of new friends in my discussion group and the program. Like I have friends from Ukraine, USA, um, everywhere, I mean, it's really cool. The facilities have been better than I expected. The dorms are new, they're not falling apart or anything. We get to have our own room, which I was really happy about. We eat at Balliol College, which is like very Harry Potter-like and very nice, so they're awesome. And it's really nice to be so close with the others, to just come over at night and talk with them. It's about a five minute walk down to, to Balliol and it's just, it's, it's scenic every morning. The weather is beautiful, it's a great walk, so you know, nothing, no complaints there. It was special. I can't, I can't say that something was um, more exciting than that. <laughs> yes! yes. Yeah. I've had a lot of memorable moments here, but I think the most memorable one, when I was really applying everything I learned on that day, because I like to joke around a lot, but the other day, a lawyer from Australia, she came over and she told us about certain case studies in South Africa. So what I did is I volunteered within my discussion group to be a presenter. And what I was able to do was I was able to present without really trying to make everybody laugh. You know, it was something that I, I felt confident in my knowledge and what I had to bring to the table. I've become a better academic because of this experience. And it's just taught me to strive for knowledge. After this, it doesn't stop. I'm going to keep on learning and keep trying to meet the challenges of democracy. Okay, London's like my favorite city, like oh, ever. Yes. Give me Kanye Bond. glass, Kanye glass. James Bond. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> if I had to say anything about the trip, it's that I honestly could say I found myself within the past two weeks, and I definitely see where I want to go in the future. Don't be sad, it's over, be glad it happened. So. We're out here, we're out, we're out. I'm going home. <laughs>